What are good poses for portrait photography? That's interesting. Okay, good. Now, if you search online for photography poses, you will get, you would just get these lookbooks, these, these stacks and stacks and quadrillions of just bing, 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 bing. All right. But it's kind of like, well, what are you going to do? Just gonna, you're just going to memorize like 50,000 poses? No. What's simpler and what I use is just the basic concept of diagonal lines. Well, why are those photos that look good, those poses that look good, why do they look good? And you'll notice that almost 99% of them have these diagonal lines in their bodies. If a photographer asks you, you know, just tilt your head a little bit, you know? It's like, well, why do you do that? Oh, it just looks a bit better because you've added a diagonal into their head. Diagonals in the body tend to look better, okay? It doesn't matter how you diagonalize it, so long as the person seems natural and they have some diagonals, that's just, that's just something you can always remember, diagonal lines.